My name is uh, John Lindell. I'm an application engineering manager. As far as the, uh, the James Webb Space Telescope project, Aerotech works with a lot of different subcontractors of NASA on a project like this. These are companies that know our accuracy and our repeatability and all these geometric specs, but they also know our ability to be able to customize systems to do exactly what they want. If you look at the James Webb telescope, it's a very unique device. There are 18 hexagonal mirrors that make up the primary optical element. Those mirrors have to be carefully qualified and calibrated so that you could get known good images out of them. Now think about it, this thing is launching into space. It's one and a half million kilometers away from Earth. It's not like anybody can go out there and do a little fix on the thing like they did whenever they worked on the Hubble Space Telescope. So the idea of making sure that those optics are in good stead and prepared to be deployed, that's where Aerotech came in. So those subcontractors came to Aerotech, got motion platforms that would be used for laser interferometric measurements of those optics and calibrating of those surfaces to make sure that the thing was exactly as it needed to be for deployment. We really are a very reliable company for them. They've worked with us for years and years, and they know that those motion systems are gonna work tried and true. And if you look at the capabilities of the James Webb Space Telescope, this thing is looking back nearly to the beginning of time, almost to the time of the beginning of the universe. That's why it took such a long time to develop this thing and do all this careful testing. They essentially needed to guarantee that it was going to work. Everybody has a hand at Aerotech in making sure that these things are successful like it certainly was in this case.